pretty much all of BookTube is reading this right now and okay. is like obsessed with it. Which means you'll get really to good. it in a year and a half or two. <laughs> Welcome to Vlogmas Day 7. It's currently 11 in the morning. I got home from work at 9 and then I played Animal Crossing in my bed and now I've just been reading. If you guys are interested, I'm reading The Reformed Vampire Support Group by Catherine Jinx. I'm almost done. Like, this is how much I have left. But it's not good. So I'm like struggling trying to push through because I'm a person who cannot DNF books. I will try like my damnedest to just like finish that book because I'm like, what if it gets better? What if you end up liking it? Like, I don't know. I just can't DNF books. I think I've DNF'd like one book in my entire life. And that was because it was just like unreadable. I couldn't do it. But like pretty much nothing is going on today. Like it is a very boring day. I have no errands that I need to run. I have nothing I need to do. So yeah, it's like a super boring day. My only plans is to just finish this book. Possibly finish The Companion by Katie Allender because I also only have like this much. I think it's like 100 pages left, but this is one that I actually have to physically read. This is my audiobook. So I can at least do like chores while I'm reading this, but can't do that for this because I don't have it on audio. But I really do need to finish it because I got it for review from Penguin a while ago and still working my way through it. So my charmed aroma candle, the ring is now out. It fell into the wax, so I'm gonna open it and hopefully it's a cute one and I'm gonna be really sad if it's not. I hate unwrapping them though because they're so waxy. My candle, daddy, my candle. <laughs> I can't do it because it's so slippery. Hey, come on. Come on. Oh, all I can smell is peppermint. <laughs> <laughs> you put it down. My hands are slippery. I can't get it open. It's pretty. Ooh. Bring it closer. Ah. And stop wiggling. Look, that is a pretty one. Ooh. Ah. Dad's rolling his eyes. <laughs> so we appraised my ring. It's really pretty. We appraised it. It's fifteen dollars. <laughs> so I didn't expect it to be worth a lot. But it's funny because it's not like sterling silver, it's just like ruthium metal or something I think the website said and that's why they were all on sale. But I still think it's really pretty. I really like it. So your girl now has a pretty ring. The package came! Yeah. On Vlogmas Day 2 I think, I panic bought five books with the gift cards that I had. Why did you call it a panic go? Because I had to sit there for like an hour and decide whether or not I was going to buy them or not. My mom is standing over there, so I'm not just talking to myself. Trash. The first book in the package is The Storm Crow by Kaylin Jolfeson. I got the second book as an arc from the publisher over there, but I never had the first book, so now I have the first book so I can binge read the entire series. It's just a duology, it's not a series. I ordered this from my library on an ebook, but then apparently my phone can't open ebooks from the library, so I never got to read it because apparently that's not a thing you can do. That's weird. I know, right? I can, dad can. It doesn't open on this one, but it opens on my old phone. Weird. Right? But this one dies in two seconds, so. You have like, to have it plugged in the whole time you use yeah, it. Yeah, so it's like, what's the point? The second one is These Violent Delights by Chloe Gong. This is like a Romeo and Juliet retelling set in like 19 something. Like Did 1920s. somebody else read that and that's why you got interested? Uh, everybody is reading this oh, right everybody. now. everybody. Yeah, like pretty much all of BookTube is reading this right now and okay. is like obsessed with it. Which means you'll get really to good. it in a year and a half or two. <laughs> Next one is Lord of Shadows by Cassie Clare. That one's thick. Cause I'm the flirt. Yeah, but I have the first book and the third book in this series. I think I read the first one. You but read Lady Midnight. Yeah. But now I have this one, so now I can binge that series because I have like the Red Scrolls and the other like spin off from that too. But you're not allowed to read those two books 
until you read this series, because I guess there's characters, there's spoilers or something. I don't know. But... Kind of like the clockwork thing and yeah. like trying to bounce back and so forth. So now and... I can read that series. And then the two that I'm the most excited about, the first one is Queen of Wolves oh, nice. by Amanda Foody. The third book in the, I don't, what is it called? Sin, City of Sins, I think. Is it over there? Yeah, I think it's the City of Sins trilogy. Mm -hmm. This is the third book. So now I've read the first two and I love them so much. So now I get to have the finale. Hopefully it's really good too. And then the one that I'm the most excited about and the one that started off this entire purchase was Sky Beyond the Storm by Sabatier, which is the fourth book in the Ember and the Ashes series, which I love. Oh, and now I have it and I can binge it and see what happened to my babies. And hopefully they're all still alive by the end. You know what you're going to have to do now? What? Rearrange your shelves. I know. <laughs> it's always the worst part about buying new books is that you have to rearrange everything. But That's now good. we got a nice good box. That's good box. See? Told you she'd like the box. So it's now 9 o'clock. We just finished watching Can I See Your Voice or whatever that show is called. And now I am going to read my book, upload the video for tomorrow, so I'm ending the vlog now so that I can go edit and whatnot. So I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Goodbye. Yeah. Welcome to Vlogmas Day. Hello. Jay is going to make me take part in watching the new Mulan, which I've heard um, is a good movie to displease people that are huge fans of Mulan. Do you not heard that? No, it was, there was controversy because the lead actress, she like supported the government there. Oh, whatever. But it's like also she can't really say she doesn't support it because then, Cause then she'll get like murdered. Yeah, so it's like she's kind of in a catch too. But I, I mean like there's no it. dragon dude. Yeah, but no Mushu, there's a phoenix. <laughs> phoenix, I mean like cool name, but like you're not Mushu. I didn't even know the guy's name until two seconds ago. I'm editing Vlogmas Day 6. You're two days behind? Yeah, because I edited my TBR yesterday. Well, you can edit two videos, you know. Yeah, but I didn't have time yesterday, that's what I'm doing now. Oh. Mom's gonna watch too. <laughs> Thoughts on Mulan? It was a great movie. But it was not convincing at all. Cool. It was a little slow. Thoughts on Mulan? Um. Uh oh. It's not so bad. No, I just, I, I. The problem is that you compare it to the cartoon. Okay, but it was but, completely and, different. And, well, no, her name was the same. Her name was Mulan, <laughs> but that's about it. I was mad because there was no. There was no let's get down to business to defeat the hunt. And there was no Mushu, so zero out of ten. Unimpressed. What was Mushu in the cartoon, though? Dragon. I, I never saw it, though. It was a dragon. But what was... It was a sidekick. It's another boring day of Vlogmas. I'm sorry. I have nothing going on. Will just went home. He always comes over Tuesday morning when he works midnights because otherwise I don't see him and he goes home and sleeps all day. So he went home. It's like one o'clock now. And I am listening to... A Court of Frost and Starlight by Sarah J Maas. I read the trilogy this year and I really loved it and then everybody says that this one is just like fan fiction basically. And I definitely see where they are coming from but I'm still really enjoying it. It's a lot of fun. And I also need to finish The Companion by Katie Allender today. I have like two chapters left of this so I'm gonna finish it tonight but this is probably gonna be a three star. Like it's okay but nothing super super duper special but those are really my only plans for the rest of the day i go back to work at three so i have two hours right now to read which is all i'm going to be doing i was just playing animal crossing always listen to my audiobook when i'm playing so that's pretty much all i've been doing and i don't think i have any plans coming off of work either like i'll probably just end up reading again maybe i'll edit a video i don't know today's a boring day i think i might just like tack this on to the end of vlogmas day seven because i don't think that was a long day either so sorry <laughs> not sorry 
Okay, so it's now 8.46 and I have spent my night finishing The Companion, which I'm giving 3 out of 5 stars, Port of Frost and Starlight, which I'm giving 4 out of 5 stars, and I've started A Sky Beyond the Storm. I'm chapter 4 so far. Still freaking love these characters, still freaking love this story. I just want to like binge read this whole thing and get it done tonight. I'm going to bed at 10 o'clock. I'm like setting that in stone i will probably try to push it and stay up later but i need to get up at 6 25 tomorrow to get to work at 7 so i really should not but like my babies are back and i'm just so excited to be back in this world so i'm gonna go read more of this so i'm ending the vlog now sorry today was a little boring but we're preoccupied with reading today so thank you for joining me in today's vlogmas and i will see you in tomorrow's video goodbye